So this Land Rover Discovery 3 just landed around 10 minutes ago into stock. It's a lovely specification. It's a metallic blue with the magnolia leather. I'm just going to show you around the vehicle and the overall condition and also some of the key features of the car as well. So starting with the bodywork, as you can see, there are no marks. It's just come from the workshop having a full PDI, pre-delivery inspection. It's got the xenon headlights, headlamp wash, rear parking sensors. So let's just go back around to the rear of the car. As you can see this vehicle it has the detachable tow bar, split tailgate so you can open top half and then the bottom with this button here. This ledge is great for um, changing shoes from wellies to boots or whatever you might be doing. It's got some seats just in the back that fold up so it's a seven seater. Coming into the back of the vehicle you're greeted with this magnolia trim. Three proper seats in the back of the car with this lovely perforated leather. It's got two heated seats operated with these buttons here and some ventilation as well but let's jump into the cabin I've got the key electric memory seats up front this vehicle was also specced with the Harman Kardon upgraded sound system electric windows throughout it's got automatic headlights also wipers So, key in, just let the glow plugs warm up, 88,600 miles on the clock, we've got the LCD display just up top, and then moving down the central stack you've got a AM FM radio with auxiliary inputs and a 6 CD changer. Down here, these are your climate control um, buttons. You've also got the heated seats, which we won't be needing today because it's a glorious day down in uh, in Barford near Warwick. There's two ashtrays here, which have never been used. Uh, that one is, oh, my apologies, there's one ashtray and then you've got a 12 volt um, that doubles up as a cigarette lighter. A six speed automatic transmission, park, reverse neutral and drive though that can be manually overridden and you can jump through the gears using the gear selector there coming back a little bit further in the transmission tunnel you've got the various off-road settings so normal which the car's in at the moment snow you've got mud sand and rocky terrain as well this is a go anywhere sort of vehicle and you can adapt the vehicle to suit the conditions that you're in. It's got the three presets for the ride height. It's riding in normal mode at the moment, but if you do go off road, um, you need some extra ground clearance. You can go into the um, extended um, suspension there. Or if you um, need access made easier, you can go into the lower. You can also lock that out so it stays like that. You've got a hill descent um, control button, high and low range settings for the gearbox for those extra steep inclines. In the center you've got a telephone um, preparation kit, you can get a, an adapter for that. And then a storage unit just down here which is ideal for CDs or bits and bobs. Coming onto the steering wheel, as you can see, you've got the indicator stalk coming down, cruise control settings and the voice command switch which is operated there. On the right hand side of the wheel you've got the controls for the radio CD player. You can toggle through from AM, FM to CD player 
um, with this button, volume control, and then you can switch through tracks or stations with that one. Telephone, hang up, answer, pretty straightforward. Now this is nice, this is a wood veneer finish to the dashboard which does couple nicely with the magnolia leather um, throughout and then you've got a switch, automatic headlights, xenons on this car. It's got a twin glove box, pen holder, paperwork and bits and bobs are there and then the bottom you've got your original book pack and the manual. Nicely spec car. Got some nice alloy wheels on it as well. Very, very good all-rounder, these Discovery 3s. We sell lots of them here at Country Car. This vehicle has six main dealer stamps with Land Rover. And the last service was carried out with Ford. So it's still a main dealer. Um, it does have the nav. Still 88,000 miles, as I previously said in the video, and it's up for 10,992. This car falls into the lower tax band, so instead of the 515 pounds, you might be swayed to a car of this age. This will just set you back 295 pounds, so instantly you've saved yourself a few hundred pounds there. If you'd like to reserve the vehicle, you can do over the telephone for 500 pounds. Give me a call, I'm George, and my number here is 01926 267 813. Thank you.